Hello and thank you for joining us on Voice TV Nigeria. Alright, let's talk about the recent killing of the Nigerian armies in Delta State. Do you know that over 17 soldiers were killed by the Niger Deltans? What actually caused the killings was a strong rift between two communities over a land. And it was alleged that Tompolo was behind this killing. The military were used to fight the other community in their favor. Okay, how about the community leaders that were killed by the same Nigerian army? My matter of interest now is that what business does the military have in this particular story? Why have the Nigerian army allowed its integrity to be robbed in the mud because of a land dispute? The military is expected to be a security agency for the protection of lives and property and not conniving to kill innocent citizens. Please, I want you to watch this video and tell me if this Niger Delta indigen spills some sense. Or what do you think? Tell me in the comment section below. This one, now be my last video when I go do concerning this Okuama and Okoloba fight. Okuama and Okoloba, they get land issue. The land issue, small crisis called the day. Oh, now, where be is your people? Where federal government give power to the bomb bakery, to the bomb dessert, and they cook? They use the same army, they escort their own, they go sell. They betray their own blood. That man, he go use the army, carry people from Okwama community. Three people where they carry, they slaughter them. Now, they know they come back to come carry community leaders. And I know very well, say, once the community leaders are captured, the youth are powerless. The action take place. Or now they make comments say, now peacekeeping, all those army come. Point of correction, no army come for peacekeeping. They, they fight in favor of Tompolo, because Tompolo have ordered them to do so. When they say, make I show my face, all these are now comments, when are they comment, now just ordinary written. Now writing, or they just they write. If I don't feel talk through for this my land, you know get where I go, go when I go talk through, when I go believe her. Now this video will be the last video when I go do. My papa, a retired captain for this Nigeria. He died last year. He retired as a captain in the army. And I don't lost over six of my friends and relatives for this Nigeria. Remember, as an army, this Nigeria is not worth dying for as a country. And they let you know. So, if you wanna like, I'm going to carry this matter from here to the next level. If you like, me federal government declare me wanted. I'm proud of it. Yes, I'm proud of it. Now they say, show your face. If I show my face, what do you go do me? What do you go do me? So to talk through for this country now, a crime. No wonder what they say, truth is always bitter. Crisis. Day between two community. When I know if you call the elders, I know if you call the leaders to settle the issue amicably. You they want oppress one side for other side. You they call them peacekeeping. I said that they keep peace. Okay, now now go school pass. Now now know the law pass. Now so oppression. This country, eh, if not before one thing, eh, I for say. Eh, Make it be like that. North, day or not. South, day or south. All army, if you deserve this country, serve with sense. If you be police, police with sense. This Nigeria, your country is not worth dying for. At the tell now, do not get sense. Why should you even threaten a full blooded indigent that is speaking out of pain caused by a failed leadership? Yes. Tom Polo too should be questioned, if not threatened as well. This is Nigeria and this is democracy. Freedom of speech and expression of impartial judgment should be allowed for a fair hearing. 
that fellow just spoke his mind. How many of you can do that? If we have more people like this, I guess things will start getting better. Yes, let's expose the ills in our society. Let's expose the ills in our nations. The Niger Delta Militant and the Nigerian Army. What do you have to say on this particular issue? Please give a thumbs up to the subscription button and follow us up on every other social media platforms. I am Patience Ubot for Voice TV Nigeria.